My name is Horst Paul Horst, most often known as just Horst. I am a German-American photographer born on August 14, 1906, and I am best known for my photographs of women in fashion taken while working for Vogue magazine. In my teen years, I met dancer Eva Wiedemann at my aunt's house one time, and which aroused my interest in avant-garde art. In the late 1920s, I left Germany to go to Paris to study under the architect Le Corbusier. While in Paris, I befriended several people in the art community and attended many galleries. In 1930, I bumped into Vogue photographer Baron George Heinegger Wayne and became his lover. That winter, I traveled to England with him and visited photographer Cecil Beaton, who was working with the British edition of Vogue. I was very inspired in photography, having spent so much time with such photographers, such that in 1931, I began my association with Vogue, publishing my first photograph in the French edition of Vogue in November of that year. I am best known for my photographs of women in fashion, but I'm also recognized for my photographs of interior architecture, still life, especially ones including plants and environmental portraits. One great iconic photo I took during the 20th century is the main Bacher corset with its erotically charged mystery that I captured in Vogue's Paris studio in 1939. My work frequently reflects my interest in surrealism and my regard of ancient Greek ideal of physical beauty. My method of work typically entailed careful preparation for the studio, with the lighting and the studio props arranged in advance. Many people remember my instructions to models as being brief and to the point. My published work uses lighting to pick out the subject. I frequently used four spotlights, often one of them pointing down from the ceiling. Only rarely do my photos include shadows falling on the background of the set. While most of my work is in black and white, much of my color photo photography includes monochromatic settings to set up a color fashion. My later work in the 1960s encouraged my Vogue editor Diane Freeland I began a series of photos illustrating the lifestyle of international high society. Coco Chanel, Marlene Dietrich, Salvador Dali, Catherine Hepburn, Paloma Picasso are all immortalized by my classic and elegant style, which is characterized by my use of studio atmosphere, silhouette, dramatic lighting, and highly posed models.